Well, ladies and gentlemen, we gotta get into this one immediately because there's some insane stuff going down in the Call of Duty cheating scene right now. Suckers are getting caught cheating left and right. Of course, the swag situations, the Z laner situation, the Nadia situation, the Bobby uh, uh, Bobby Poff situation, right? The Bad Boy Beamons, the Call of Shames, and suckers are going crazy. And right now, we had the Rick situation. People are getting doxxed. And now, what we're learning is that Bobby Poff ended up getting like 300 plus nukes in his career. And after he got banned, he ended up getting zero. So that's like what's going on. I want to actually get into it. Like the video if you love your mama. Uh, like the video if you love God. Uh, don't like the video if you love somebody else's mama though. But uh, let's actually get to it. A shout out to the homie Call of Shame Roller. Wait for it. Wait for it. I got a bunch of clips. All right. Wait for it. As the personality of a pineapple, Jay God, you will okay. defend cheating streamers and constantly try to make them look better than they are. It's widely accepted that streamers are awful at Call of Duty. We all saw how bad they all played at the World Series of Smoke Zone, it was embarrassing. Recently, someone raised a genuine question. Okay. He said, Jay God, please, please explain, explain to us, us how come players like Joe, Breadman and Omid T are dropping high kills from their bedrooms, and when they go to land, they play terrible. Facts! They Facts! Like, I, I kid you not, I saw this comment, okay? So this is like absolutely hilarious if true. After the ban in last 8 days, Bobby stats are 0 nukes, 0 0.56 KD ratio, multiple middle fingers, and F you guys to his viewers on stream. And in his career, he got more than 300 nukes. Constantly keep saying because they are in a lobby, against the best in the world. Now, I thought this was a fair facts. and honest question. Facts! Facts! But Jay God wasn't happy. Uh oh. Do you want to really know? Or are you too far brain rotted? <laughs> For example, the average lobby while at home has a lobby KD of between- And now, to be fair though, like, that's like one of the factor too, right? Because, uh, like, if these suckers are gonna go at land, they're gonna compete against, like, other Call of Duty athletes, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> other Call of Duty athletes, right? You know, that- uh, uh, Yeah, makes sense, though, makes sense. But still, though, like, you see a night and day difference, man. Like, at home, they're, like, killing it. They're, like, lasering everybody. Like, they're, they're like, pow, 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 pow. At, at home, they're, like, uh, or I should say, at land, when they're, like, whoa, 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 whoa. They do not know where to shoot but at at home they're lasering everybody at land they don't even know in 0 0.85 to 1.30 when compared to land it's closer to around 4.5k no it didn't you know something can you imagine if this channel didn't exist and nobody called them out for this crap streamers boost stats we all know this this is why they are two boxing because they are getting yeah. literally destroyed in skill-based <laughs> matchmaking because they are not the players they are claiming to be yeah. so stop trying to use their kds to justify a high lobby what yeah they like to tick 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 guys they like to tick 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 man they be juicing out there you are looking at is day one and day two from the world series of warzone this is the global final and right away you will notice diaz biffle even the codcasters were laughing that someone can get a high KD against the so-called best players in the world. Bruh. Everyone in green has a positive Bruh. KD. And everyone in red is negative. As I scroll down... I mean, it's so obvious, though. It is so obvious. Like, not everybody cheats, but majority of the big gameplay-specific streamers are cheating. They are. It's as real as those ufos flying on top of your head guys like it's not rocket science and if you guys are into ufo content conspiracy content definitely check out the second channel man scary x we upload there every single day uh and uh, yeah like if you are into that content you love watching that sort of content at night i would love to have you there definitely check it out right, let's get back to the content here boo boo and i want to show you guys like the doxing situation too though on this list you will start to see stats that resembles a bot lobby now we will take the KD from day 1, and then day 2, and create a real lobby KD. We will use okay. basic elementary school math, to take the total KD of the players, then divide basic. it by the lobby list. This is absolutely not a 4.5 KD lobby. Can I tell them? Absolutely. Okay, so- but, but what he meant was like, you know, they're competing against like other Call of Duty athletes, Bruh. right? Like other Call of Duty athletes. So the competition is kind of stiff is uh, what he tried to say. But yeah, right, like 4.5 KD in this day and age with that thick of skill based match, again. Oh man, miss me with that, bro. Get my mom with that, bro. Drum roll, please. You're not getting a drum roll. Just oh, tell come them. come on, it would be cool. Just add a little drum roll. Tell them roll or in. I will. Okay, okay. 
So the KD of the World Series of Warzone Lobby is 1.08. And that is a freaking stinking bot lobby. So when you no. hear streamers telling you they are the what? best in the world, please remind them. Hey, yo, what the hell? 1.08? That's crazy, bro! What the hell? And you, stop spreading misinformation. And as for streamers dropping high kills, that is a complete load of nonsense, and I will Yay. have a video about that soon, showing the lobby, the kind of people joining, and more. I went a step further, I asked the AI assistant, is a 1.08 KD lobby on LAN in a world championship final considered good? And would you suspect players cheating at home? In a world championship LAN final, a 1.08 KD lobby would generally be considered low for a high level competition especially for top-tier professional players who typically maintain much higher KDs, mm, often mm. 1.5 or more in competitive mm, settings. Mm. In a yeah, if you get like 1.5, you're like in the in a close call with Call of Duty athletes, right? 2.5 plus at home and around 1.08 at land. This could raise some suspicions. A drastic drop, yeah. Land setting, where conditions are controlled, you'd expect most players to have refined skills, higher reaction times, yeah. and better coordination, which would- Bro, at home, like, these things are lasering everybody, though. Lasering everybody. But at, uh, at, like, LAN events, they're like, where, where? Oh, okay, there? Pow, pow, oh, did I land my shot? Right, like, it's like that, bro. At home, they're killing it. They're, like, lasering everybody. Usually drive up the average KD. If players competing at home in online settings have significantly higher KDs compared to their performance at LAN, like 2.5 plus at home and around 1.08 at LAN, this could raise some suspicions. Facts. A drastic drop in performance on LAN could suggest the possibility of unfair advantages, like cheating, when playing from home. There we are. I ask if the streamers have a 4.50 KD lobby at home, as J God claims, and these same people could only achieve a 1.08 KD lobby on land. What conclusions would you draw from this? After all, they tell us they are the best in the world. And for the AI assistant to give me a yes or no answer and a small closing comment. So, are they cheating at home? Yes. <laughs> Yo, you, okay, he's like uh, a asking this question to the AI. And AI is like, yes, yes. While it's difficult to definitively say without evidence, for sure. the drastic difference in performance raises legitimate concerns about the integrity of their online gameplay. It highlights the importance of transparency and accountability in competitive gaming. This one is notorious for spreading misinformation. He is attempting to name notable people within the Call of Duty scene who have been permanently banned. There's a bunch of people that have been permanently banned in Warzone? Um, that uh, people are aware of. Obviously, Wagnificent is probably the, one of the most notable. Uh, Bad Boy Beaming got permanently banned. That's how he started his content with his channel. 5x5 oh, Five Five got banned. Call, Call of Shame's main account got permanently banned. Uh, we got Bams. Uh, he got permanently banned. He hey, said he hey, 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 whoa, whoa, hey, 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 tranquilo, papi. Yo, papi, chill, papi. Damn. Damn, man. The, the plot thickens, ladies and gentlemen. I'm not sure whether that's true or not, bro. Like, yo, call of shame, bro. Okay, well, let's see. Uh, he's probably gonna respond. Let's see. It was account sharing as well. Uh, Torba, Paysetter back in the day. It's Hoppa. Now he's a hacker hunter, too. A lot of times, if they're a hacker hunter, usually their, their previous account got permanently banned. If, if you look for their original account, it, it doesn't exist. But when I first saw this, I knew this was a fantastic opportunity to expose the lying streamers. Okay. You see, I play on a PlayStation 5, not okay. a PC. And I have shown clips of my games regularly on this channel. No, my account is not banned. Oh, thank my God. My account goes back to the PlayStation 3, to the Resistance Fall of Man Day. Oh, thank God. Thank God, man. Thank Yo, God, bro. Thank God, man. Finally. I miss the PS3 trophies days, bro. I, I miss these, uh... I, I used to be like a massive grinder in terms of, like, platinum trophies. I believe I got, like, 20-something, then I stopped.
Uh, but uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Man, trophies were uh, simple times, man. I remember that. Like, just seeing the P PlayStation 3 UI just brought some memories back. What was your favorite console if you were there around that time? Like, Xbox 360 or PS3? I mean, both consoles were amazing. I just enjoyed the free online, free to play online on PS3, which, as a brown man, bro, like, as a, as a brown man, like, I, I want to see free to play online come back on the Xbox and PlayStation, man. But these things are crazy, man. Launch title on the PS3. You can't get any more OG than this. Yeah. Upon signing yeah, in yeah, today, yeah. there are no problems. But it's what we expect from streamers. They lie constantly. They always make the claim. Everyone thinks all streamers cheat, which is not. Yeah, not, not all streamers cheat. I, I get what people try to say, what fans try to say, like everybody's cheating, uh, it, it, but, but it, they just mean that a lot of people are cheating, essentially that's what it is, but objectively speaking, not everybody's cheating, but majority of the big streamers are, majority, not everybody, for sure, like it, it's kind of hard to find like a real uh, streamer, right, but I want to like really quickly like show you guys this, shout out to the homie Ghost of 8, 8 thoughts, uh, check this, so Call of Duty cheating scumbags docs the Rick, the Rick also is one of those uh, channels right now i believe uh, uh that that finds hackers cheaters and exposes them so he's also doing some good work so it, shout out this to is the what's rick. going down the rick has been and, and he got he got yeah uh docs right making videos exposing people like the hero and this other degenerate no life having dickhead i don't know what an x pro mvz some fat face wanted looking like Tranquilo, puppy. Yo, puppy, chill, puppy. If Mr. Gold broke ass, not having a whole lot going on. Dead ass channel, considering the guy's got 554,000 subscribers. Probably, I don't know how the hell. It's a dead channel. The dude gets less views than me, and he's got half a million subscribers. I, I, I would say, like, he just need to change up the, the content, right? And then he will be popping. Like, Call of Duty is not as hot. I mean, he's doing, like, so class setups. Yeah, I mean, class setups are not the... Maybe, like, when Black Ops 6 comes out, like, for the first two weeks, it would be. But then it's like... Yeah, right? Like, Call of Duty just don't have the same appeal. Uh, that it once did. Subscribers, everyone has realized this dude sucks. I don't know if he uh, sub bought or whatever because this guy is done. So I don't understand why he's being such a bitch about things because no one cares about his opinion. But nonetheless, he out here doxing people. We also got this fat face, Down syndrome looking guy who looks like he's had a stroke by the name of Hero. Also fat as well. There seems to be a theme here. These guys are all fat. Probably could sit in our ass all day, two box and playing Call of Duty. But we have this dude, Hero, who looks like a Down syndrome Mexican guy. And we also have this Frizz Eyes guy who is. Oh, man. Oh man, que pasa, brother? Que pasa? What 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 is going on? He talks ocho ocho pensamiento, brother. Like what the hell, man? Also of I believe the Mexican uh, persuasion. He is a pen. Pendejo, pendejo. All right, breaking news here live as I was about to put this video up on YouTube. Frizz, I okay. I need to stop that uh, because he got it too, bro. <laughs> Okay, let's let's see. He's reached out to me in the direct messages to clear his name and to give his side of the doxing situation. So got he it. said he wanted to let me know I did not dox anybody. I repeated the name that Hero said months ago. I do not play around when it comes to that stuff. The exposing okay. videos you and him make, I don't take personally. And even okay. if I did, I'd never do something like that. So facts. I replied back, okay, okay, what do you mean by repeating a name that... I should not be saying facts. Maybe maybe it's facts, maybe it's not, but okay. Hero said months ago, just Rick's name, like his last name too. That's not really doxing, just being lame. His reply back was, Hero said something along the lines of Mrs. wouldn't like that, referring to his fiance. I said the same thing in his chat, referring to the instances when Hero said that. That is literally it. So he is saying that mm. he was giving the name of Rick's fiance, her whole name, or Rick's last name, I guess, because she's going to be marrying him. It doesn't matter. Kind of lame, nonetheless, to bring in someone's wife or girlfriend and giving her name and putting her on blast. Not doxing, really, but kind of not a cool thing to do and i believe yeah. that would be an apology situation there for his eyes because what are you doing talking about the dude's fiance or wife's real name when we're talking about call of duty kind of pathetic behavior Crazy. we now join our regularly scheduled program already in progress so yes the rick has been making some call of duty videos exposing two boxing which has been going on for a long long time and exposing dudes for cheating which is cheating right there's between cheating and hacking that for the uh, smooth brain morons out there who have downs as well hacking is when you have like actual little downloaded cheats by cheap yeah. providers like aimbot wall hacks that's hacking yeah like this is a crazy youtube thumbnail that i saw <laughs> my god my god aim button aim key aim bot it's a real one, right? I don't know which uh, it is. I guess it's called AC Diamond. Safe mode. Aim type. 
aim smoothing targeting type aim location aim fov what the actual hell bro back in my listen man back in my days bro seconds would have just like used like a red dot in the middle of the monitor and it would come in built in right and people would call yo you cheating you juicy you juicy man you know my my daddy plays call of duty without having the red dot in the middle of his monitor <laughs> right like there used to be crap like that back in the days but nowadays these suckers are advanced and though recently this sucker also got caught cheating check out this video on the screen and i'll see you right there if you've already seen it then check out the video on the left man insane clips man insane clips bro.